don't know. I don't know where the leak came from, not to the best of my uh, recollection. Um, I, I don't know the answer to that question. I, I don't know whether that was something we considered. It. I do not know. I'm not aware that I am, I am making assumptions here and I do not recall anything. I don't remember. I don't know. When was it I found out about this? Uh, I can't remember. I, I, I don't know what I don't recall. Beyond the individual uh, detail of this, uh, there is an underlying issue, which is about the uh, powers of the Parliament, the powers of a parliamentary committee, the obstruction from the civil service, the obstruction, as I see it, from the Crown Office and the leadership of the Crown Office in terms of the parliamentary committee doing its job. I, I believe and hope uh, and know that among this committee there would be a desire to be able to discharge that function if it was clearly able to do so. We've examined the, uh, the issue of uh, Clause 162 and whether there can be exemptions from it and, and whether that presents difficulties and the behaviour of the Crown Office with regard to it. I think there is a solution, and I'll offer it to the committee and leave it in your hands. Hitherto, you've been serving orders as a parliament on people who've been unwilling to give you information. Can I suggest that you use your powers under the Scotland Act, and it's a matter for this committee, to serve that order on my solicitors, who are extremely willing to give you information? It's a matter for this committee, but if you do so, eh, then I'm sure you'll get full cooperation under the law from my solicitors. Eh, furthermore, if we're on a roll here, uh, then the information of the letters from the Crown Office preventing me from furnishing you with that information hitherto is something you might also like to request under, uh, under the same powers of the Scotland Act. And any other information which Mr Whiteman has, has uh, come up with today, which would also be of assistance uh, to the committee. Uh, for example, the uh, official... Record, uh, sorry, the official record of the Commission on Diligence, uh, which uh, I also think I have all these documents here as it happens. Uh, but uh, if you decide as a committee you would like to go down that course, and clearly you've got to deliberate, uh, then if you serve that order on my solicitors, you'll have the documentation on Monday morning uh, in time uh, for your uh, sessions with the Lord Advocate, and I understand it, the Crown Agent, Mr David Harvey.